Hi friends, it is sending rain and I'm being quiet because we're not taking the kids to church today. <laughs> Ashley had a hard day yesterday. She didn't feel well. Part of that was because she didn't take her medicine in the morning and had a hard time eating all day. And so then took her medicine last night and then didn't go to bed right at right away when she was supposed to when we were gone. Right she away, was, you mean like midnight? Yeah, well she was so awake when we got home at 11. So anyway, we're just gonna let the kids sleep today. And I know that's probably like, I don't know, don't judge us. <laughs> kind of parenting. Kind of parenting, I don't know what you wanna call it. But. Um, Instead we should take their Christmas away because they're not acting Oh right. no, you can't go there. <laughs> you can't go there. Those of you who know that family. Um, <laughs> uh, we're losing our dominion over our kids. Oh, stop. Okay, Jason did something really sad this morning, and that's why I wanted to, like, document this. I have tired eyes. My eyes look so tired this morning. Maybe I need my other fr frames to, like, brighten up my face. But Jason did something so sad this morning. I I heard yeah, him. I'm surprised at your reaction. I'm, I'm really sad about this. So, I'm, I'm getting ready. I'm sitting at my makeup table. I'm getting ready, and he's in the bathroom, and all of a sudden, he starts laughing and chuckling and he was like oh and I was like what? what what did you do and he didn't say anything and he finishes getting ready and he comes out and I ask him to go get me my water and um, my water and an ibuprofen because I have a headache and he comes back in and he's like uh so I kind of did something I'm surprised by my reaction too I was more or less surprised whatever no big deal so tell him what you did I messed up shaving and so I had to shave it all off and I look like no uh, but there but anyways I don't really care about it but well, I'm glad you left it still kind of scruffy so it looks like you're still growing it out but I like <laughs> it I didn't know how much I liked it I really didn't know how much I liked it until it was gone I guess um anyway so kind of I should sad leave. I should leave for a while what do you mean and like and then I'll miss you <laughs> Whatever. So I am sad that his little scruff is gone, but it'll come back. It'll, <laughs> a couple days and it'll come back. So anyway, that kind of made me sad this morning. So we're just kind of straightening up and putting our stuff away from last night. We didn't really do that. I just came home and, and had to like straighten my hair right away because I don't like to get up super early on Sunday mornings, but I really like to start my week out with my hair straight so that I have a couple days with it. So we're just gonna finish getting ready and then we're gonna go to church and it is cold. I always know how cold it is overnight if my heater turns on because I have it set very low to have my heater turned on and it turned on twice this morning. And there's no frost on the windows or door or uh, roofs, but anyway, we will catch up with you. We just got back from church. Everyone's still asleep. It's been like two and a half hours since we left and clearly they needed to sleep or they're, they're hanging out on their iPads. Let me take off my shoes here really quick. I wore my orange dress today. But I'm gonna go put pajamas on again. But I'm gonna go see if they're awake. Chelsea's probably awake. She sits on her iPad trying not to wake up Ashley. Let's go see. Is she awake? Oh, they are awake. Did you just wake up though? You didn't. <laughs> you owe me one. Letting you sleep in. You had a hard day yesterday, but you need to get better sleep tonight, okay? Yes, it's already coming up. No, no. No, that's no. not. At 11 o'clock, they were gone. With what this on, it? way longer. It stinks in here. Who tooted? Dad? No. No. Someone you did. Say whenever I, didn't, I don't you think come it smells. Here. Did you? No. It's rank. Dad, it says when he comes up the stairs, make one. How and many? Then. How many squash mallows do you think you guys need? Um, I only have three. I have technically four. four. <laughs> I don't know that there's any. We. I mean, they won't get rid of the blankets or the squash mallows, and there's no like room there, to sleep. There is. There's really not. We'll have to show them these ones you got. Oh, this one's bad. Well, here, put them in the case, and then we can show those later. Because yeah. they're really cute all together. Mm -hmm. I know you do. Okay, I'm going to go change into jammies. I also have to keep track of them because it's so hard. They roll around and... And then there's this, like, crack so they can, like, go through. I know. Through, so all right. Okay. Little, little stinkers. Actually, it was, oh, I mean, she was awake at 11 o'clock when we got home last night. And everyone left with Kaylee's friends at like nine. So that excuse of, oh, they're so noisy. It's total BS. 
BS. Okay, so I come into this closet here, and Jason's like, oh, I can't find my cozy pants. I don't know where it is. I just, I, they were down there. Oh, were I in. wonder, I wonder why we can't find anything. Well, they were in my filing system. In the uh, filing system. They, a little, they got mixed with the exercise stuff, where it should have been here with the casual stuff. <laughs> don't even know where the distinction is it's between mess. Here. It's more of a nebulous. Or like up here. I mean, at least we have this going. Well, these are these are shorts and blue jeans that I'll probably never wear again in my life because I who wears blue jeans anymore? Well, people, and then I have we other do, pants but... here that I have shorts and I have uh, shirts. <laughs> You're ridiculous. And they, this is all piled because I'm going skiing tomorrow. Now I'm going to go relax. All right. You found your cozy pants? I found my cozy pants. All right. All is right in the Just mess. Just be happy I'm wearing pants. <laughs> Like, nowadays it's like <laughs> pant free time. All right, so I took a very needed nap this afternoon. I had a headache coming, well, I had a headache waking up at six o'clock this morning and it did not go away. I worked here at my computer for about an hour, hour and a half while I ate lunch. And then I was like, I can't even keep my eyes open. So I took a nap on the couch. I was, it was like one of those naps where you're like out and you physically can't move your body. But sometimes every once in a while you can hear people talking and like even Kaylee came in and asked, is mom awake? I have a question for her. And I was like, if I move right now, I will be awake, awake, and I don't want to be. So I just pretended like I was asleep. Nice. And I went back to sleep for like another half hour to an hour. But Jason's over here, I'm um, working at the desk, and he's putting in orders, and he's asking me you know what colors to order in certain shoes and and I was like well these ones are cute and the gray and the tan but I don't know if that's gonna work with your demographic because it's a little over, older and he was like you know that you're at the bottom of my demographic now <laughs> you are but he also said that I'm, a, I'm one of his customers. hardest customers pickiest pickiest customers because I return so much and I said well it's a good thing I get things for free or else I wouldn't be coming back if that's how I'm gonna be treated well, considering how much you return, it wouldn't be a problem. <laughs> You've been making money, I'd be paying you the $25 stocking fee every time. No, we don't charge that very often. I charge you on that tan shoe or the red shoe. They didn't work for me. Like, seriously. Just saying. Yeah, he better slowly walk away. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, I am working on videos. I did something fun the other day and it really is all because of you guys. Because I've been getting so much support and getting this channel growing and I have been able to earn money from YouTube every single month on a consistent basis. That for Hawaii because my little uh, spending fund is all because of you guys watching these videos. So thank you to our future Hawaii trip. But it also means that I know I'm going to get paid for the month of March. And so I decided since I have now a whole nother year to save up for Hawaii, I decided to take- So you're months. saying a year. We just have a year now, right? It's not gonna be every six months. Oh, would months. you like to go six months? We can go in six months again. You, you keep turning it quicker. <laughs> I'm expecting to turn it every three months here soon. If I can work a deal and you can have high enough sales to earn us the points, I'll go every three months. Shh. That's the goal. By the time we have kids out of the house, that could be the goal. We have like we 10 years. <laughs> I know we have like 10 years. Anyway, but I don't need that money that I'm going to earn this month, given it is not very much money. And you could even look this up and find out exactly how much it would possibly be. But I, it, I don't know if you know this, but the music that I used for my YouTube videos I have to find that music because it can't have any copyrights on it I have to get permission to use the music and the site that I use is pretty reputable in getting that kind of stuff but every once in a while a, a video will pop up and give me a, a copyright strike not a strike but it'll give me a warning that I'm using copyright music and then I don't get paid for it that video I can either edit the video or I can take it down but I most likely will not earn money on that video and sometimes it doesn't matter because I know that video is so old and it's not doing anything but other times it's a good video and I need to like edit it and it takes a long time to be able to do that and it gets really frustrating I have wanted to join it's called epidemic sounds and it's online and you have to sign up for a you know subscription it's a year subscription or you have to pay on a monthly basis which is more expensive but then you get full access to like 90,000 songs like 60,000 um like sound uh, what do you call it sound effects you don't ever have to worry about the copyright you're basically paying for a licensing fee every single month in order to use that music and so I finally have enough money to be able to put into that and I went ahead and paid for my year subscription and I get it free month if any of you guys are watching and are youtubers and would like to do that yourself I have a link down below and you can look at that there's a referral code and you too can get a month free if you want to join it you can click that and get your month free off of my referral but 
but it just means that I have access to all this music and it's so fun to like I sat there for hours yesterday just going through all these songs and I'm getting to use some of them today in, our, in the video that I'm editing and oh, it's just so nice to one find like really fun songs and I can take out the vocals or I can add the vocals. It's just going to make my editing so much more enjoyable for me and also a little bit less stressful in thinking I'm not going to get a copyright strike. Anyway, I know that's maybe a little bit behind the scenes, but I just want you guys to know that you gave that to me. Like that was a gift you guys gave to me to be able to afford to do that because as we've said before, this channel is funded by itself. If I need new cameras, if I need discs, if I need music, it comes from the payments that I get from you guys watching. So you guys are literally, when we say thank you for supporting our channel, you're financially supporting our channel by watching. You are financially supporting our vacations. And, and I know that there are so many of you who enjoy our vacation videos so much more than our daily videos, which we do too, but you're literally making it possible for us to be able to travel. 100% making it possible. And so we will talk about that as well when we're in Hawaii because a lot of our excursions are possible because of you. I just wanted to thank you guys for giving that to us and it's hopefully growing and if the more you guys watch the more the channel grows so thank you for doing so I just gonna keep editing here until dinner time with the kids I really haven't even seen half of my kids today because they become hermits on Sundays but they need to like have a decompressed day before they have to go back to school so Jason anything oh uh, no I'm commenting on one of the videos so <gasps> look at that a dutiful husband dutiful yeah. Do I no. understand about you? Like, no, oh, you're not. Well, no, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> you just call me your worst customer. That's what you just did. You just mocked me. No comment. No comment. I don't know how those two relate. Because you're saying I make fun of you. You do make fun of me. Right, and so do you. You make fun of me. Mine's based in fact, though. <laughs> <laughs> so it's mine. <laughs> So my dad, um, just, well, my, my sister, Erin, she's right there, <laughs> just texted and they're all at my dad's house having, there, Erin, say hi. <laughs> so we're setting up a Zoom call. My dad wanted a Zoom call with me and my brother who don't live there. And uh, they're having technical difficulties. So I thought I would share what we're doing. <laughs> That's my dad's mantle. Uh, they'll figure it out. They're trying to get it hooked to the TV so that everyone can see it, but uh, that's what we're doing right now. Give me all your love, oh, cause I want you. No one else makes me feel this way. All right. Oh, I look kind of a shoveled mess. It was fun to have a little call with my family. They were all there having dinner at my dad's house and they just suddenly said, oh, we should Zoom with Dana and Dan, my brother who lives in North Carolina. And then while they were all there, our neighbor's daughter, the one who passed away, the daughter was there still from the funeral yesterday. Um, I don't think she lives there. Maybe she does. Maybe she moved back to Utah. Um, but she was at her dad's house, which is two doors away. And so she came over to say hi to my sisters and uh, got on the Zoom call with us and said hi to me. And we got to talk about our mom's funeral and she was like I'm so glad you got to join in anyway it's just really neat to like be able to talk to her I told her I would try to book a flight to come home and she's like oh my goodness no she's like you could just zoom call and do exactly what you just did um, which meant a lot to her to know that I had listened into the funeral so then Ashley came begging for Rice Krispie treats what? right so she helped me make them really quick and they turned out pretty good right now it's time she doesn't feel very good still right we're just working through this maybe veggies will help I know it doesn't seem like veggies will help us okay let's not <laughs> she's like packing it in i think we're good this is the spoon my dad gave me uh well with my sister um they kind of went in on a little christmas slash birthday gift for me when i went down there and uh, excellent spoon such a fun spoon works really good because it's really tall also i'm gonna get my pan for my sister and my dad because jason's dad is gonna go to utah so they're gonna get my pan for me <laughs> So maybe we'll have to initiate the pan and make some fudge and try and make it work this time when I get that next week. So, but you need to go shower now. Yeah. You've eaten, we've made our Rice Krispie treats. You're nibbling, because that's what the cooks get to do, correct? <laughs> but you need to go take a shower and go to bed, right? School this week, okay? Good night. All right, nothing else is exciting going on tonight. The kid, two of the older two are upstairs doing homework and Chelsea's already gone to bed because she's able to regulate her system very, very well. I don't know if we've taught her well or just her personality, but she's like showered, she's eaten a, a good meal and then she just had a light, a light snack with some fruit and she's like, I think I'm gonna go to bed. I've got my water bottle filled up, I've brushed my teeth. I think I'm gonna go to bed and it's seven, what time is it, 7.34 and I just remembered. I just put tater tots in here to warm back up because I had missed getting them while I was on that call. Oops, they're gonna be a little bit crispy. <laughs> 
So I'm gonna just enjoy a little bit of the nibble here with my tater tots. We had spaghetti and uh, green beans for dinner a little while ago, two hours ago or so ish. And uh, gonna have a little nibble here and then I'll, I don't think I'm gonna have any of these cause I, I had some earlier today from the old batch. But we're gonna say goodnight to you guys. A little bit of a short day, but um, his little scruff is growing on me. Do you need a new razor? Yeah, my little special one like broke. Okay. Is that like a little trimmer to like do the edges and stuff? Okay, we'll have to look at that tomorrow. He's going skiing. I'm talking to Jason. He's going skiing again tomorrow. Probably one of your last times going. Yeah. Right? The weather's warm enough. Then I'll have to just go climbing. Oh, he's like way down there on the ground. You can't even see him. That's fine. You go climbing and come back way earlier in the day than you do skiing, so. Anyway, we're gonna sign off with you guys tonight. He will join yes. me tomorrow for a Costco run. Because that it's normal. We finally had a normal day, but we'll say good night to you guys and take care. Give me love, give me all your